First of all, everybody, happy Thanksgiving. Uh, hopefully you get to enjoy it with a limited family appearance. This is gonna be our COVID cranberry sauce. Super simple. If you've ever made simple syrup before, just equal parts water and sugar to get it started. Uh, the only thing we did ahead of time is we rinsed and washed our cranberries thoroughly. Feel for any soft ones. Sometimes every once in a while there's one that went rogue. You can see one right there. The other things that I have, uh, I have the juice of two oranges, and then I also have some orange zest. What I don't do is I don't put my orange zest in there while it's cooking. I think once orange zest starts to cook, it turns a little bitter almost. So I leave that to the very end, actually, once it's fully cooled. All right, so we'll just get started. Heat on. Get your water. Fresh orange juice. Sugar. So we're gonna bring the water and sugar up to a boil. Make a simple syrup. Literally nothing like watching water and sugar boil. And then we're gonna add our cranberries to that, that mix. And then once they burst, that's when you're done. Hear them start to pop. So you can actually see them start to split a little bit. Do you cooking. want to? Sit down. <laughs> Sit. So we noticed we've cooked about half a liquid out. The cranberries are definitely nice and soft now. See how they just fall apart? I think that's perfect. Kill the heat. Just kind of give it a little bit of a mash down with your spatula. You can throw it in the food processor if you want it smooth. Throw it in the blender. That's fine too. Put it straight into a container and straight into the refrigerator. And what it will do then is we'll actually thicken up a little bit. Look at that color. So now that it's cool, we'll just go ahead and add our orange zest in there. Just brighten it up just a little bit more. Stir that in. Per your request, Mom, make cranberry sauce for your turkey since you're doing all the cooking. So we'll go ahead and wrap this up. Pack up the family and we'll see you on Thanksgiving.